This is a brilliant time of year as we come out the Hungry Gap. Everything's starting to come out. Herbs are at their best right now. It's a plethora of flavours. After waiting so long and having so little, we now have an abundance. Strawberries are just starting, so you get a mixture. You get some wonderful ripe ones, and then you get these really different, really tart little green ones that haven't quite ripened up, but add a real point of interest to dishes. So we're going to do a little savoury salad of strawberries, and we're going to prepare them in two different ways. We're going to pickle the green ones. So pickling is one of my favourite things, and these lovely acidic, sharp strawberries lend themselves really well to being pickled. First of all, I'm going to put 100 mils of cider vinegar into a pan and then two tablespoons of caster sugar and a big pinch of sea salt. To that, we all know, or well, everyone in the know knows that black pepper goes really well with strawberries. So we're going to add 10 black peppercorns and for a little anise kick, two sprigs of tarragon, 50 mils of water. I'm going to bring that to the boil. While that's coming out to the boil, we're going to prepare our strawberries, just taking the very top green part off, but leaving them whole. I'm going to drop them into this bowl. They really are a completely different flavour and ingredient to, to red strawberries. There's none of that sweetness that's been developed by the sunshine. They taste a little underripe, but they're really underutilised. So to complement our strawberry salad, we're going to make a salted yoghurt. We're using 200 grams of hang-up, and I'm going to add into that 200 mils of double cream, a little pinch of sea salt. The yogurt's already salted, so we don't want to add too much salt. And then a quick zest of half a lemon. And then we're just going to whisk that all together just to lighten up that salted yogurt. We're going to drop that in the fridge so it sets a little firmer. Once your pickling liquor's come to the boil, just pour it over your green strawberries and leave it to sit. I'm going to prepare the other ingredients for our salad. It's really quite simple, these beautiful red ripe strawberries. Let's take the top off, just going to cut them down into quarters. We're going to add into that a few radish slices and then just a few capers chopped through. We've got these lovely salted capers. We're just going to chop them through very slightly. I don't want to break them down too much. Just about a teaspoon of those. So it's been an hour and our strawberries have cooled down. They've taken on the wonderful flavours of that pickle liquor. They're nice and soft. It's going to cut them in half. So into that we're going to take some of our lovely anise herbs. First up the fennel. Just a few sprigs of wild fennel. And we're just going to chop it through. We don't want it too small. We want people to be able to see what it is. And then our tarragon, our lovely French tarragon, these tiny little leaves. We're just going to pick them off as whole leaves and just drop them in. About half a tablespoon of our pickling liquor. Good drizzle of Babylon store and olive oil. And a little pinch of sea salt. And then we're just going to toss that all together. We're just going to spoon this into the bowl. Finish it with a nice big scoop of our salted yogurt. A crack of black pepper and some fresh tarragon leaves. 